you get to this weird, dumb planet? Orphan in my home world. Those pools, they remind me of a time when I took my daughter through the forgotten lakes of my home world. You're a man looking at the world through a keyhole that you spent your whole life trying, and now on hearing that it can be widened in ways you can't imagine, you reject the possibility. You think you see through me, do you, or you don't? But I see through you! You think I was wrong to cast him out? Five hours later, he's still on your doorstep. There's a strength to him. Stubbornness, arrogance, ambition, I've seen it all before. He reminds you of Caecilius. I cannot lead another gifted student to power, only to lose him to the darkness. You didn't lose me. I wanted the power to defeat my enemies. You gave me the power to defeat my demons. And to live within the natural law. We never lose our demons, Morda. We only learn to live above them. Can I ask you a personal question? Oh. No one has ever asked me a personal question. Your antenna, what are they for? Their purpose? Yes. I think they have something to do with my empathic abilities. If I touch someone, I can feel their feelings. You read minds? No. Empaths feel feelings. Emotions. May I? All right. You feel love. Yeah, I guess, yeah, I feel a general unselfish love for just about everybody. No. Romantic, sexual love. No, no, I don't. For her. No. Okay. <laughs> oh, that sucks. She just told everyone your deepest, darkest secret. Dude, come on. I think you're overreacting a little bit. You must be so embarrassed. <laughs> so unbelievably oh. uncool. Oh. Touch me, and the only thing you're going to feel is a broken jaw. Do the frost giants still live? When I'm king, I'll hunt the monsters down and slay them all. Just as you did, father. A wise king never seeks out war, but he must always be ready for it. I'm ready, Father. So am I. Only one of you can ascend to the throne, but both of you were born to be kings. Why have you done this? To prove to Father that I am a worthy son. When he wakes, I will have saved his life. I will have destroyed that race of monsters, and I will be true heir to the throne. You can't kill an entire race. Why not? <laughs> and what is this newfound love for the Frost Giants? You could have killed them all with your bare hands. When I'm king, I'll hunt the monsters down and slay them all. Unchanged. So have I. <laughs> I never wanted the throne! I only ever wanted to be your equal. I will not fight you, brother! I'm not your brother. I never was. Loki, this is madness! Is it madness? Is it? Is it? Come on, what happened to you on Earth that turned you so soft? Don't tell me it was that woman! Oh, it was. Well, maybe when we're finished here, 
I'll pay her a visit myself! I'm glad Spider Man. I mean, what would make you think that I was Spider Man? The fact that you, like, disappear out of nowhere, but well, then you're Spider Man. Wars are fought with weapons, but they are won by men. We are going to win this war because we have the best men. And because they are going to get better, we will choose that man. He will be the first in a new breed of super soldiers. Not really thinking about picking Rogers, are you? I wasn't just thinking about it. It's a clear choice. <laughs> Look at that. He's making me cry. I am looking for qualities beyond the physical. Do you know how long it took to set up this project? Yeah, All know. the groveling I had to do in front of Senator What's-His-Name's committees? Rob, yes, I know. I am well aware of your efforts. Then throw me a bone. Hodge passed every test we gave him. He's big, he's fast, he obeys orders, he's a soldier. He's a bully. You don't win wars with niceness, doctor. You win wars with guts. Get back! The dummy grenade. Is this a test? He's still skinny. We thank you, High Priestess Aisha. What is your heritage, Mr. Quill? My mother is from Earth. And your father? He ain't from Missouri. That's all I know. I see it within you. An unorthodox genealogy. A hybrid that seems particularly reckless. You know, they told me you people were conceited douchebags. But that isn't true at all. Shit, I'm using my wrong eye again, aren't I? I'm sorry, that was... That was meant to be behind your back. Count yourself blessed they didn't kill you. Every citizen is born exactly as designed by the community. We control the DNA of our progeny, germinating them in birthing pods. I guess I prefer to make people the old-fashioned way. Well, perhaps someday you could give me a history lesson in the archaic ways of our ancestors, for academic purposes. I would be honored, yes, in the name of research. I think that could be pretty, uh, pretty repulsive. I am not into that kind of casual. Oh, please. Your people promised something in exchange for our services. Bring it, and we shall gladly be on our way. Hey, big guy. Sun's getting real low. Didn't see that coming.
stay here. You'll die. I just did. Do you know how it felt? <laughs> Where did Captain America learn how to steal a car? Nazi Germany. Hmm. And we're borrowing. Take your feet off the dash. All right, I have a question for you, uh, which you do not have to answer. I feel like if you don't answer it, though, you're kind of answering it, you know? What? Was that your first kiss since 1945? That bad, huh? I didn't say that. Well, it kind of sounds like that's what you're saying. No, I didn't. I just wondered how much practice you had. You don't need practice. Everybody needs practice. It was not my first kiss since 1945. I'm 95. I'm not dead. Nobody special, then? <laughs> Believe it or not, it's kind of hard to find someone with shared life experience. No, well, that's all right. You just make something up. What, like you? I don't know. The truth is a matter of circumstance. It's not all things to all people, all the time. Neither am I. It's a tough way to live. It's a good way not to die, though. You know, it's kind of hard to trust someone when you don't know who that someone really is. Yeah. Who do you want me to be? How about a friend? 